I am from the Philippines. I am from India. <laughs> I'm originally from Nepal, but I'm now living in Glasgow. I'm from the UK. I am Kenya, but I work in Rwanda. Over the past two weeks, we've had a series of interactive participatory workshops and lectures. We are learning about different uh, components of neighbourhood, how we can tackle uh, the health and education uh, situations and issues in the developing countries. I think what's so exciting is that we're all united by this common goal to create this body of research in whatever form that may take that addresses kind of the global challenges facing um, rapidly urbanising cities. We knew the partner countries but hardly knew who the members were and who the researchers are so we definitely had a good networking within this workshop. I've been able to learn how to do about six new things. You know at first I was just like how oh, is an old lady like me going to be taught how to do these things but the training was so good so it was really really empowering. We've got uh, speakers from different backgrounds from different institutes coming over and then um, telling their experiences. Every country has their specific contextual ways of doing things in terms of research and they also have different um, strengths and weaknesses. So we were able to find ways for the project to move forward and grow and learn from each other. In as much as our cities are different, at some point we need the same lens. So if we are looking at neighborhoods, we need to understand what exactly are we looking for. So this was more of a forum that puts us together. Aside from the fact that we were able to uh, improve our skills, we were also able to meet other members of the project. It's really been a great way to exchange ideas about the project and thinking about how to move forward.